Gator Land. Welcome to Gatorland USA. That's not a gator. Hey, hey, no, that's my microphone. You're on my, no, ah! Hey everyone, hope you're having a truly magical day today. Uh, I, I'm here. <laughs> I made a promise. Okay, let me go back a little bit. A couple weeks ago, I made a promise. I said, if we reach our goal for Give Kids the World Village, very special, amazing organization that makes dreams come true for criti critically ill children and their families, we met our fundraising goal. And I promised we would do something extra special if we met that fundraising goal. We doubled it. We went 200% of our fundraising goal, made dreams possible for two different families. And because of that, I am facing an immense fear of mine. Immense. And I'm already ready to leave for Gatorland USA. So walking in now, there are a lot of gators already on my right, but I want to just reiterate the fact that this is all thanks to you. You made dreams possible for Many kids. There are two different families that, I mean, the fact that we made it to $10,000 is just astronomical. It blows my mind. It is, it just, it means so much to me. It means so, so much to me. And this is just, this is just a great way to celebrate. And I'm facing a fear and I'm just glad to be here. I'm not sure how much we're going to do today, but today is actually Gator Palooza. So they're doing extra special things for alligators. And I'm seeing a lot of them over there and some over here. And just super terrifying. Anyway, let's head on in, see what we see. There's a lot going on Gator Palooza today. Thank you again for making dreams come true for some very special kids and their families. Gatorland USA, here we go. Here we are, very first time. I'm nervous to even walk on this bridge to give you an idea of how I feel at this moment. I, if my camera shakes just a bit, you'll know why. For uh, this Gator Palooza day at 2 p.m., they have a, cl a close encounter. So, so we're up, cl up close encounter. Sorry, I'm, I'm like looking around as I'm walking here because these waters are infested, hey, with alligators. Um, I'm, I'm a little terrified, a little terrified, and people are feeding them, but we're gonna try and find up close encounters. Okay, baby alligators, I can, oh my gosh, they're feeding the baby alligators with this, you see the little ropes? Oh my gosh, they're feeding them. They're, oh my gosh, that's terrifying, oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna have to try some cool things. We're celebrating today. Oh my gosh, it's a small one, small ones are fine. Now, I don't know Gatorland at all, I have a map here. Oh, there's a, there's an area for dining right over here. And there's up close encounters apparently over here. There's a lot happening. We're, we're just gonna try and explore and figure it out. I'm guessing that there are bigger. Oh my gosh, that's enormous. Oh my gosh, that's huge. You see that gator right there? Oh my god, just looking. I, I can't even. Oh my gosh, I'm on this bridge. Okay, sorry. I'm just. Oh my goodness. That is. Um, yeah, I'm. I'm a little. I'm just a little nervous here. I'm sorry. I'm just like. I'm in kind of a mode here where I'm a little. A little uncomfortable. <laughs> Just gonna pack up here. Um, that's a big gator. That's um, it's a large one. It's by the. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and. Yeah, that's that's a big alligator. Well, I wanted to push myself to my limit. Um, okay. Well, we're gonna watch something from a different angle. I, I'm I'm actually I'm honestly pretty terrified. I am. But this is. This is good. This is facing fears. This is good. Oh, look at the friendly birds. I like, I like the birds. Hey, birdie. I like the bird. I am so terrified of that. Oh, that's so cute. We got so many birds in here. Ah, see, I like the birds. I really like the birds. I, uh, uh, there's a lot of alligators in this water, though. And that, that is so large, it's hard to describe on camera. We're, we're trying to find the up-close encounters first. I might need that photo op right there. Okay, here we go. We're going towards up-close encounters. This is apparently where they're having a very special show. Oh, cool, goats. Yay, goats. I like goats. Goats are good, too. Okay, we made it. It's almost 2 o'clock. There's a lot of people waiting for the show. I think, let's see if we can find a seat here. There it is. Up-close encounters. Right there. I'm going to take over here. You're going to feel something really gross in your hand. Don't worry, that's just going to be me. You're gonna open your eyes and meet your new friend in 3, 2, 1, open those eyes! Right? <laughs> you know what, at least touch it! Touch the butt! Yeah, touch, touch the, the butt! butt. All right, we're going to the goat section so I can slowly get warmed up towards uh, the bigger gators because I got to tell you that was extra terrifying. We're going to go say hi to some of our uh, four-legged friends here. Oh, cool. Look at that goat. That's so cute. Oh, hey, here's a sheep. Hey, sheep. How you doing, buddy? See, that's friendly. Hey, buddy. Good to see. Oh, he's wooly. Oh, super wooly. How you doing, buddy? Hey. 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 How are you? Oh, I don't have any. I should get some food for you. Look at that guy. You're so friendly. Hey, friendly guy. 
Hey, hey, good to see you. I'm hungry. Oh, you're, I, I know. I don't have any food for you though, buddy. That's so cool. You get real close to these. Love your horns there, bud. Hey, hey, how you doing? Are you scared of gators too? I think you might be. Yeah, you like the scratches. Ear scratch. Look at that guy. That's so cute. Hey, buddy. Some extra food right here you missed, buddy. Here. You want some up? Oh, there you go. Yum, 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 yum. It's delicious. Oh, there he is. In addition, we've also got the capybara here, who I believe is the largest uh, member of the rodent family. Hey, capybara. That's so cool. Like, please. First impressions, I'm having a great time. Um, I haven't really done many gator things yet, but <laughs> I think we're about to. Okay, I promised myself I'd do it. I'm, oh my goodness, this is a, it's too, too much of a rickety bridge. <laughs> okay, I, I'm walking on it. Oh my goodness. Well, I have never been this close to a, a dinosaur in my life, but that is, no doubt, a dinosaur in the water. Here he goes. Yeah. He's gonna eat it. This is my hand. Okay. Here we, I'm sorry if I don't have the same level of energy as usual. I'm just, uh, I'm just trying to not panic. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm completely surrounded at this point, and I have more, more of this to go. This is, uh... This is pretty terrifying. There's a gator right on the uh, the green right there with birds all around him. Walking around, you can see more of the birds, like the flamingos. I'm gonna stay on this side of the, the bridge for a moment. There's David being brave. There he is. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, flamingos, how nice. Let's 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 pay attention to the flamingos for a moment. Oh my god, this this piece of meat. Gator chill. There's food for feeding them. I'm not sure about that level yet, but there are a lot of gators out there. Look at those things. They're just sleeping out there, basically on each other, made it to the edge. Ooh, ooh, that was like a little battle going on over there. <laughs> not always friendly to each other, but they're swimming all around. They're eating a lot of food. They are, they are prehistoric giants. Absolutely enormous creatures. Whoops piece of food right there. Going for it, there's that food. Got it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow, my brother is literally leaning over the fence where I won't even approach. <laughs> David's brave, that's what we call him. Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. David, David, do you know how close you are to that gator? You're close, you are close. Oh my gosh, there he is, right down there. That is a prehistoric beast. Oh, there's not so much food for them doing Gator Palooza. They're almost full. Oh, there you go. He grabbed one. Okay, after a lot of uh, Gator viewing, hey, we got a flamingo here. They're hanging out. Wow, I've never been this close to the flamingos before. They are super, super close. Wow, my gosh. Oh, there's a turtle down there. Wait, see the turtle over there in the water? Wow, that's so cool. I didn't realize they had so many different animals here at Gatorland. They're throwing the big meat chunks on this side. Not sure if this is the sign for the gators. I think it's more of the feed the flamingos. They've that all the food is gone, so they've definitely been well fed today for Gator Palooza. There are a lot of them out here. Love seeing them. Okay, we've experienced these massive prehistoric creatures on this bridge. Get me off the bridge! Okay, made it to the end of the bridge. We've got uh, the Fudge Kitchen Gator Chow. Uh, you can get a one bag for three dollars with a lot of meat in it. That's uh, that's a pretty good deal to feed those gators. So maybe I'll maybe I'll try that another day. Not 100 percent sure. They got the birds in here. I kind of want to go. Say hi to the birds. Oh, they're not open right now. Uh, seeds, uh, $2. You know, I don't really know if uh, it's included with our admission, but part of me thinks it is. So David and I found out that this bird aviary is uh, closed for now, but will reopen in about 45 minutes. We're gonna try and check it out. It'd be really cool to see those birds and feed them. I'll probably get some bird seed. That'd be great. I'd love to do that. Chester, the big dog eater. Yeah, that's... Uh, Okay, that's why he's by himself. Oh, okay. He uh, apparently was not the friendliest skater. Liked to eat dogs, and uh, now he's here by himself. That's uh, it's pretty terrifying. David and I are reading that uh, Chester apparently didn't get along well with other gators. This is why he's by himself. He's got his own pool, so that's nice. Back at the parrots now, checking them out. Apparently they do bite though, so can't get too close. But awesome to see them. They're right here, like right in front of us, super close. It's a cool parrot. I've never been this close to, uh, oh my gosh. It's really, really incredible to see them this close. And they definitely are moving. Yep, and talking too. Hey buddy, how are you? I'm just looking, I'm not getting too close. The camera's close, but I'm not close. I'm all the way back here. Yeah, he's, he's just hanging out. There's another one right there. And, and technically I know I'm not facing my fears by looking at the parrots, but I love them. They're so cool. Oh my gosh, look at that bird. I don't know what kind it's called, but uh, 
It's a super cool one. It's like a light pink, almost like white pink color. It's awesome to see him. What's your name, buddy? I'm gonna call you Carl. How about that? Hey, Carl. How you doing? I don't know if that's your name, but I'm gonna call. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. He's giving me the eye. Okay. Bye, Carl. Okay, we're back at the main section, and oh my gosh, that was just reaching out of the water there. That's moderately terrifying. <laughs> and this is the uh, Gator Jumperoo show, and this big chunk missing out of the bottom of the Jumperoo sign. So, yeah, we're gonna just hang around here for a second until I gain the courage to walk across the bridge. Ah! Oh my gosh. Okay, we're close again. <laughs> These gators who are just sitting here, sun a little bit. Monsters of the deep. We're gonna see if we can see some of the baby ones. Okay, here we are. We got the uh, two to four year old gators. Okay, that's a little bit better. <laughs> there's so many of them. There's so many gators. So they are two to four years old and there's birds that actually come on in and join them from time to time. That was interesting. But you can see they're just kind of hanging out, sunning together, like lying on top of each other. And uh, yeah, it looks relatively Harmless, re re relatively. Here's even more of the two to four year old gators right there, and even more. They've got uh, one after the next after the next. There's a lot of these younger gators here, all two to four years old. When they graduate, they go to the big gator area. This is Junior Jumperoo right here where you can uh, feed the smaller gators. So that's cool, that's all right. Okay, we're gonna have to do that a little bit later. I saw them doing it when we walked in. Uh, but I think we might try that a bit later. I've, I've just been walking around exploring a little bit. These are the three to five year old gators. So they get a little older, they come on over here. I can only imagine how they transport them from one to the next. But, <laughs> oh, that was a big yawn. Yeah, that was a big yawn. But lots of gators here. So, uh, initial thoughts of Gatorland. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Great way to like, help uh, those with extreme fear of alligators to get a little bit more comfortable. I'm very comfortable around the, oh, he's looking right at me. Hey, you wanna be on camera? Okay, two to five year old, oh no, uh, two to four year old, two to four year old gators here, three to five year old gators there. I'm comfortable here, going back and forth, and I'm feeling good. Um, I, will, I will continue to evolve the skills. Dave, initial thoughts of Gatorland. It's Gatorific. Ah. Nice to see the variety of activities and animals they have for us to enjoy here overall. It's cool, it's a lot more than I expected. I'm pleased. I agree, I was expecting just very small amounts. There's like thing after thing after thing. We're seeing the parrots, so the birds. I wanna go into the little birdhouse. Aviary. We gotta do that, it would be aviary, and we wanna go, um, maybe try food? Maybe, maybe, maybe. But we wanna see tortoises too, so we're gonna do that. I've seen this sign in, um, in jokes before, you know, trespassers will be eaten. Uh, this time I think it's true, I, I believe it. Yep, believable. Learning about Luther, I'm guessing that's the guy we saw a little earlier when I was super petrified. Maybe I'll get a chance to say hi to him again. But he is the big bad gator of the main lake. I'm not sure if that's Luther or not, but that's a humongous gator. That's, that's it. David, you're too close to the edge. <laughs> it's too scary. Oh my gosh. I don't know if that's Luther or not, but it's part of the Jumperoo show. Um, Dave, what's this ladder used for? We're going in. Uh, no, 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 no. 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 It's just for show, is my hope. Um. Peter. Okay. That looks like Luther out there. I'm uh, trying to get the bravery to. Yeah, that, that looks like him. Right there. Big, bad, scary alligator. There's a whole water park section here. That's cool. Not sure how comfortable I'd be even like close to water when Luther's sitting in the pond over there. You know what I mean? Pond with Luther, water play area. Pond with Luther. Okay, friendly tortoise time. Yay, friendly tortoise. Panther Springs right here. We're gonna decide Panther Springs or, oh, there's pythons and there's tortoises. We're gonna go quick because we want to make it to the aviary in time to go check out those birds. There he is, you can see the jungle cat hanging out right back there. See, to me, he's far less scary than the alligators. I know he might be like scary, but he's he's cute. I like him. Cute little panther. Oh, there's more than one. Look at the guy under the bridge over there. They're just hanging out. They got their friends. I like the fact that they're not alone. They've got a buddy. That's super, super cute. Oh, he's moving a little bit. He's dreaming. I love it. Here's the python house. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Little snake right there. Little terrifying snake. Not as scary as alligators. Do you can see my reflection more than the snake? There he is. I don't speak. Yeah, okay. All right. That's okay. 
Sorry, Michelle, I tried. Oh my gosh, I found the baby gator marsh. Take a look at these cute little guys. You got the albino gators right there. That's cute. Then you got the super baby ones. They may have, I don't know, hatched very recently. They look like they're recent hatchlings. Oh my gosh. See, that's not as scary to me. That's, that's far less scary. The adult scares me, the, the baby not so much. Look at the albino turtle in there. Oh my gosh, wow, I've never seen one before. That's so cute, he's a baby one too. When are we, okay, we gotta go find the more full-sized ones for sure. Oh my goodness, that is so close. Oh my goodness, I have never been this close to a tortoise in my entire life. This, okay, so there's a tortoise, there's my foot. Tortoise, oh my gosh, okay, oh hey, hey buddy. Hey, that's my foot, hey. That is unbelievable, unbelievable, I love it. I love it so much, that is so cool. Oh my gosh. Truly amazing to be that close to that tortoise. I mean, you could have easily reached out and pet it. Easily, you're not supposed to, we didn't, but it, it was that close. Now we're going to the aviary, see those birds. Oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh. They're holding a gator and a python for a picture. Oh my goodness. I know you're saying, Michael, get the picture. I'm horrified, I don't know if I can. Oh my gosh. Moderately terrified of that experience, but I think I want to do it. Here goes the aviary, we're going in here, we're gonna go say hi to some birds. Birds on the ground, we're being extra careful. Walking in, I want to get a picture of a, of a bird. Look at those birds! There's so many! Who wants to say hi? Oh, Michael! You gotta watch where you step because there's so many birds. Oh my god! They're all over! They're everywhere! They're so cute! Okay, we've got sticks to feed the birds. David, you're up! Oh my god, that's great! Wow, that's great. Look at that. You see his eye? You see his eye? Oh, he's on your wrist too! I love it! Oh, that's so cute! Oh my god! Yeah! He loves it! Oh my god! <laughs> they love it, oh yeah. Just got him. Oh, look at that. Right there, yes. Land on the camera, here. Yes. Michael as a tool. Look at that. Look at that cute driver. Michael, go. Oh, he's on me. I got another one. Come on. Come on. Being very careful with the birds. There's one on my head. There's one on my head. Is he gone? Oh, he's just crawling on around. It's soft, right? Gentle. soft, yeah. Yeah, oh. you can hardly tell they're there. Oh, yeah, there you go, oh. buddy. Woo. Loud slamming. Scary. Now we're gonna go down. Here we go. Go, Mike, go. Yay! Nice catch, Mike. Wow, look, look at that. Look how close he is. So He's right close. there. Beautiful. Hey, bud, how are you? Got another stick of food right oh. here. Oh, oh, I got a customer already. They love the fresh one. The fresh one is their favorite. There you go. All I gotta do is hold it up real high. There you go. I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. All the different colors. It's so cute. Digging into that fresh one. I gotta say, this is a truly amazing experience. They are all around us, these small little birds, maybe called parakeets, I'm not sure, but you can see we've got a lot of food here and a great, great experience for everyone. Wow. Oh God, he, wants he, he wants the shirt. He wants the shirt. Oh, David's the bird, bird man. There he is. Birds seem to love our shoes. Take a look. We got a bird shoe party going on over here. There's, I don't know what's tasty. I think like the seeds from the sticks dropped off the shoes and they like hanging on the shoes. That's so cute. Look at these guys. Look at this. I can move around gently. He's just enjoying his seed stick there. This was, this is so amazing. Oh, he left. I'm sorry. I scared David's away. I'm sorry. That was amazing. Hey, we're closed. You didn't get the memo. Hey, we're closed, buddy. Welcome to Gatorland USA. That's not a gator. Hey, hey, no, that's my microphone. You're on my, no. Ah! Some of them don't cooperate too well together. I'm trying to find a spot where they can enjoy the seed stick, but at, the aviary is technically closed. Hey, guys. Hey. Hey, whoa, 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 no fighting, no fighting. There's plenty of seed stick for everybody. There's plenty, oh my God. Ah. All right, technically they're closed. They're about to bang a big... Ah. All right, Dave, we just finished in the aviary. We fed some amazing parakeets. Is that what they're called? I don't know, birds. small birds. How was it? It was awesome. Okay. Incredible, fantastic, loved feeding those birds. Would most definitely come back just to do that. It's that good. 
five dollars for three feeding sticks and they were all over us. As soon as we brought out, they saw a stick, they were like all over. They were just like, let me get to the stick as fast as possible. They were you know, trying to push each other off from time to time. Sometimes they were sharing. But let me tell you, that was an experience I would definitely do again. I'd, I'd come back for that. That alone. Yeah, I, I like the, the gators. It's Chester. Hey, Chester. It's scary, but the parakeet so far was my favorite. But now we've got more to do, more to see. So much more. Let's do it. We've made it to the snake section, and that, my friends, is the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake. And I'm glad it's behind some glass. <laughs> oh, I'm glad to see it behind glass. <laughs> it's just terrifying. But you know, not as terrifying to me as the gator. Wow. Those are scary. Take a look, he's making his own snow cone right there at the hamster wheel, look at that. And she's shaving the ice with the power of him running. Look at that, the kid's right there, he's running, he's having a great time in the hamster wheel and making his own Sunday. Dave and I just found a completely different section of Gatorland. I didn't realize how far back it went. There's this breeding marsh here. It's just full of gators and I'm, I'm, my bravery is increasing with, with every passing moment. This is how I have to do it, like slowly. Here we are, the breeding marsh, there's no fence over the edge, which scares me quite a bit, but you can see <laughs> there's a lot of gators in there. And there's one super big one right there. And David's too close to the edge again. <laughs> it's just, I'm just kidding. We're having fun together. A lot of gators in the water. Pretty terrifying. Look at that gator yawn, gator yawn. Oh my gosh, that's super terrifying. Super terrifying gator yawn. But is this gator pregnant? See how it's like really big in the, it has a really big belly there. So this is the breeding marsh after all, so. Yeah, might be a pregnant gator. Wow. David just reminded me, because I did remember, I just get a little worried, so for me, it, I'm not really thinking straight. Gators are amphibians, they don't they don't get pregnant, they lay eggs, so maybe it was just a larger gator. I don't know, I'm not 100% sure. We're just walking around, trying to not panic, but having fun, having fun. Food is definitely tasty for the gator. Oh my gosh, that was, every time they eat, I'm just terrified. I was looking at the people. We're ready to feed them. Here we are, adventure hour. We've got rub a dub dub. Wash your hands in the tub. We've got the adventure outpost and the stomping gator off road adventure, along with the zip line up above us. Voted top 10 zip lines in the world. Maybe I'll do this one day. I just, I haven't made it to that point yet. There's a zip line up there. David, are you willing to do a zip line adventure? Yeah, it was scarier than expected when I saw how close it went to the water. Right. Yeah, I would do it. Okay, you're braver than I. So Dave and I are going to commemorate this very special adventure by getting a commemorative photo holding um, a creature. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Hey, buddy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hey, buddy. Oh my God. Uh, I think that counts as me uh, overcoming my fear. I just held a baby gator in my hand. That is overcoming my fear right there. That counts. We did it. Oh, I got the picture too. Wow. Here we go. We are now back at the baby and semi-baby, three to five year old areas where we can feed the gators just like she's doing right over there. Okay, now we're gonna watch a very special feeding time. These are the two to four year olds and they're doing the junior jumping. And we're gonna see him eat these fish. So to be a part of the junior jumpers here, you actually have to string your own fish on the, uh, the little hook that they're putting together over there. And then the, oh, the gators already know it's meal time. They're hanging, over, they're hanging out over here. And they're gonna jump for their food and tear it off of the line there. Here we go, it's the jumper Oh my gosh. <laughs> Over here, you guys can get fish and a fishing pole to help Ooh. us teach our little gators how to jump today. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> they're, they're getting ready. They're all looking at that fish. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, wow, that was close. Oh, it was so close. <laughs> He's gotta hold it still so they can get it. Oh. Oh, he was so close. Oh my gosh. Hold it still, hold it still. Oh, he was so close. Oh my gosh. Yes, he got it. Yes. Oh my gosh. That was amazing. It was super cool. David, what do you think of that? Oh, we're doing it again. Uh, jumping gator, cool? Love to see that one. That's that's a lot of fun. And the baby's doing it. So we saw a couple guests feeding those baby gators. Really cool. Well, we might try it next time. But we did some amazing things today. Let me tell you, the birds were so much fun. We'll do even more in the future. 
This was great. This was truly great. I loved it. See you later, alligator. <laughs> this is awesome. Now as we're making our way out, we're taking a look at some of the merchandise that they have here at Gatorland. They've got everything you can possibly imagine from gator door knockers. That's cool. Look at that guy. That's awesome. Too real. Uh, look like gator belt. Hmm. Maybe? Hmm. Actually? Not quite. Where's David? I gotta ask him about this. David? Oh, David's got the cane. He was looking real cool. Yeah, he's looking fly. With that cane. I just got the hat. That is quite a cane, David. Oh yeah. It looks a little chompy. <gasps> Some of the things they have here are incredible. I love this wine bottle holder. <laughs> Oh, it's so good. Wait, how much does this little guy cost here? $37.99 for that guy. Take a look at these super cool sauces here. They got gator sauces. I hope that's not real. I don't know if it's real or not, but I hope not. Bubba Gator. Is that steak sauce? Steak sauce. Yeah. I don't want to ask if it's real or not. The claw and we saw on the steak sauce. I don't want to ask, but they've got a lot of cool stuff in here. Just so much. They got socks, shirts, you name it. Bracelets, jewelry. Sunglasses? My gosh, she keeps going and going. You find so many amazing items in this gift store. Wow, <laughs> so much, so much. Now David and I caught Gatorland from two different perspectives. So don't forget to check out Dave's vlog from Gatorland, linked in the description, his channel, linked in the description of this video. Be sure to check it out. This was a great day. Gotta tell you, I loved Gatorland. It was so much fun, the birds, seeing the gators. I was, I was scared. I was scared at first, genuine fear, but it evolved into fun and just respect for these amazing creatures. I really do want to come back and learn more. I was so impressed. Really, really happy with the experience. Dave, what'd you think? It was a fantastic time. Really glad we had a chance to see it all. A lot more than I was expecting as well. So it was a lot of fun. And just like that, our adventure has come to an end. Thanks so much for sharing in the magic with us today. It was so much fun sharing it all with you. Until next time. Have a magical day. See you real soon.